In this video, we'll cover the keycard puzzles found at the underwater labs in Rust. The underwater labs are procedurally generated monuments that contain readily accessible loot that spawns throughout the monument, loot from dwellers that patrol the labs, along with loot from a variety of puzzle rooms. To make the most of your trip, it's recommended to take a couple green and blue keycards along with a red keycard and two or three fuses. While each monument's layout and size will be different, you'll find a mix of the same types of rooms at each. There are green and blue keycard rooms that are immediately accessible with the swipe of a card, and there are puzzle rooms that require a few extra steps to solve. If you come across an unpowered keycard door, or a door only giving you the option to knock, there will be a puzzle to sort out nearby. In this example, entering the green keycard door, we find a fuse box and a couple of switches to hit. Once we've done that, the blue door nearby is powered and we're good to go. As you explore the labs, you'll find other variations of this throughout. If you're lucky, you'll come across a red keycard room. These rooms will provide a couple of elite crates along with additional loot. For this first example, if you drop your fuse in and then swipe your card, you'll enable the timer. Activate the timer and the door will be powered to allow you in. In this second example, there are a few steps to solve, with a couple sets of fuse boxes to power and switches to hit. Once all have been activated, the red keycard door is powered and we're able to enter. As you explore the monument, keep an eye out for more variations. Since the labs are procedurally generated, there's always a chance for alternative rooms and puzzle modifications to be added in the future. With that, thank you for watching. I try to keep these videos simple. If you found this useful, check out my other keycard tutorials, and I'll have more to come in the future.